Hello and welcome to my channel. This is Denny and I'm here with the 24th day of 30 days of lipstick. And to everyone out there, happy Thanksgiving. I'm going to make this short and sweet because I have to get back downstairs. I've been all day cooking and I just needed to pop up here and show you my lip color that I've been using today. Um, so if you want to know what color I chose for today, keep on watching. So today's lipstick is from a brand called Absolute New York and this brand is new to me as well. It's one that I picked up at Gen Beauty and I believe the only other place I've tried it is through Ipsy as well. So this color that I'm going to be putting on today is from their Velvet Lippy Collection and this is considered a uh, buttery matte lip cream. And the shade that I'm going to be putting on is called AVL 14. So I'm going to go ahead and swatch that on my hand to give you an idea of the color. This one to me looks like a like a soft raspberry color because it's not really deep but it is in the berry family. It's not too dark. It's a little on the light side when it comes to like raspberry. I'm going to go ahead and put that on so that you can see how that looks on my lips. So there you have it on. From what I'm seeing in my viewfinder, it looks a little red on camera, but I promise you it's more like a muted, even, it even reminds me of a fuchsia, but just like more muted, if that can be a description. But definitely in the raspberry family, it feels really soft. If I had to compare it to anything, this feels exactly like the NYX, what are they called? the soft cream mattes by um, NYX, it feels identical as that would feel on the lips. So if you are familiar with the NYX soft matte lipsticks, this feels exactly like that. And it's really soft um, and buttery. I have a feeling that even though it's matte, it's not a, yeah, it's not smudge proof. So you see, it will move around quite a lot. So it's just like a soft matte lipstick, but not a long, I guess long wearing. Let's see. Even with the wipe, it comes off pretty easily. I'm over here wiping it, wiping that off. So it just came off really nicely. It's not one of those stay put in place matte lipsticks that kind of lock to your lips. And I don't see any staining behind, which is actually a good thing. Because usually with colors like this that are more like on the purpley, pink, fuchsia, or pink side, they kind of do stain the lips a little bit and even like your hand when you swatch it. A couple of the other ones that I've done this past week have stained my hand, but this one did not. So my mistake, I was looking at the lipstick and on the bottom it does have a name. I didn't realize this one is called Razzle. So... They do have names. For some reason, I didn't think that they had names. And on the website, I just saw letters and numbers. So excuse me for that. So the price range on these is $5.99. I don't know, other than their own website, I don't know of any other place that actually carries them. And like I said, I'm only familiar with them because I've got them through Ipsy. But I've never ordered from their website or anything like that. And these, the ones that I do have, they were completely, oh, well, this one was completely free because I got it Gem Beauty. And um, the other one that I have, which is a gloss, that one came in one of my bags. So they, that one wasn't free, but it's still, it's paid for in the cost of your bag. If it's anything like the NYX Soft Matte Lipsticks, I'm going to love the formula because I do love those lipsticks and I have tons of them. Um, I actually have, well, I have at least 10 of them, so that tells you how much I really like them. 
So if you like this series and you want to continue watching, go ahead and subscribe, leave me a like or a comment. As always, from my house to yours. Love ya.